Hello and welcome. I am Zyander and we are back again for more silliness in Skyrim. I've got uh, one dagger equipped. I am a lizard wearing some light armor. And uh, we are going to follow along this path. One weird thing about the uh, just this little part here that I've never understood and it Nobody's ever understood it. If you ever watch anybody you freshly watching it, the fight the watching Skyrim. it, freshly playing the game, seen the true face of the Empire here today. Um, what this what guy says up ahead is, is a complete lie. And it confuses a lot of people I've watched that are playing Skyrim for the first time. Which is... Should be when getting close to the stones, ruining something, baby. See that ruin up there, Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could what? stand. Oh, the up there. Indeed. I guess you get used to it. Hmm. Attention. The Guardian Stones. The Guardian Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead. See for yourself. Now, as you can see, there's three stones here. There's other stones. What these do is, um, you have one. You can only have one stone buff active on you at a time, but it's a permanent buff until you select a different stone. The Warrior increases your combat skills. The mage increases your mage skills, magic, and such. And then there's the thief stone, which increases things like stealth, pickpocket, I guess sneak, not stealth. But uh, since we are playing, see, those under the sign of the thief will learn stealth skills 20% faster. Thief, eh? It's never too late to take charge of your own faith, you know. Oh, shut up. Okay, I'm going to show you guys. Now, you see how these are in three different colors? Like how the backgrounds change between them? Uh, that's because those show the different signs. If you look very closely, you can see a warrior dude in the background, a mage, or a thief. Which... Don't... I have no idea, but anyhow. Oh, I have an idea, but I have no idea. We're putting it that way. And I see this little mine icon. That's with that uh, symbol up there on the top, near the east and slowly revolverating around me. Revolverating. Uh, that is the signification of a mine. And we are going to go to the mine. Now ain't this a surprise. And this person's not happy to see me. Do your worst. It's nothing. Oh. oh. Brutal. <laughs> Just completely brutal. Whenever it comes to those little kill cams, or whatever you want to call them. I'm used to seeing the stealth attack ones. I don't think I've ever actually seen a straightforward knife kill like that. That was unexpected, yet very crazy. Now... That looks dangerous. But we're going to pretend it doesn't exist. We're going to harvest those mushrooms. Rock trap. Oh. See, I walked over on this side and I didn't even notice that. There's a tripwire there. X 
accidentally avoiding things. Okay, that dude's going that way. Where'd the other guy go? He went to sleep. Heard nothing. I did level up, however. That's what that uh, cool little noise stands for. Okay, health, stamina, or magicka. I think it was stamina. And obviously, sneakiness makes me more sneakier. What was that? Uh oh. Oh, sees me. Steel sword. Oh, that reminds me, I didn't search the other bandit, did I? I should do that. Steel mace. See, none of these things really have any value, and obviously I'm not going to find any magic stuff at the beginning of the game. Perhaps... Ooh. Iron ore vein, but I do not have a pickaxe. But that is proof that this is a mine. Ooh, coin purse. Tether journal. They've had me walking down here for days now. It is not the time that's getting to me though, it is these tunnels. I have told them countless times now to add extra supports to the weak sections of the tunnel. If only we had more of those wooden beams that we are reinforced with the bronze bottoms. Honestly, if I hear the earth shift one more time above my head, I'll be so stressed I may stop drinking for good. I mean, what's a Nord without his mead? Hopefully that wasn't too fast for you to understand, but it was just a small journal entry and I figured it was worth reading. In a silly voice, of course. Appears to be nothing up here other than a lever. Lever or lever? Who knows? I decided to say lever because I've noticed that as I talk more and more to people not from this country, I very slowly start speaking a bit like that. Speaking of speaking like people from other countries, I was looking up why exactly the English language, like American English and British English are so different. God, my lizard looks badass. And partly due to the fact of how the language had progressed from all the immigrants we had had, and partly because of the fact that the common in uh, like English you think of now, like the British English, is actually uh, what was considered more of a, I guess, posh, rich English back then. Just jack these things through here. Spell tome. Well, I'm not too big on spells. Salt pile. It has effects, and therefore it is used for alchemy. But, uh... Yeah, that was more of the uh, rich person, person, rich person's kind of English. Not exactly the kind of people that would cross the ocean as pilgrims. Oh! Well, I was going to attempt to turn this into a bit of a comedy. However, I thought right, things are going. That seems impossible. It is just too brutal. But perhaps if I can come up with some witty comments to say. Banded iron armor. What am I at? 191 of 305. Mm, not really interested in those. Oh, barrel? What do we got here? Ah, mushrooms. Alchemy ingredient. Potato. Just restores health. Nothing important. Health. Oh, 
salt. So, oh, I didn't search this guy. Hey, key. Hmm. Whoa. What was that all about? A little bit of a darkness there. coin purse because it has coins Ooh. I said it was moving around too quickly anybody there fur gear is as good as what I'm wearing. I should take it and wear it just because I'm sick of looking like an Imperial. The game could be lying to me though. It does that sometimes. Fur armor. Fur boots. Fur bracers. How do I look now? Well, I am... I'm now a half-naked lizard. This is fine. I'm a lizard. There's nothing to be worried about. I will run around killing them merely with my dashing good looks. Iron ore? Might as well take it. Workbench. See, I'm not really going to do any smithing. Because even though it can make me really good armor and stuff, it becomes a little excessive. And it's also cheap levels. Ones, like, levels that feel so dirty to get that it just kind of makes you a little bit sick. I am probably going to craft a set of regular leather gear if I can get the leather to do it. Just the base leather armor. Um, but... What are orcs doing in here? But, uh... That's about all the farther I'm going to go. Ooh. How about you? It would be mildly amusing, though, if I ran around as a naked lizard. Just to see if NPCs said anything to me. Put some damn clothes on, man! Anywho... Sprinting! Oh, what appears to be all that was in there. Now, I know I was supposed to be going to Riverwood, but, uh, come on, this is Skyrim. It's all about exploring and doing things, right? And long load screens when frapsing. Now, my plan for this episode is going to be we're going to do some random shenanigans listen to the little storyline of the quest from going to Riverwood and then prepare for the like we're not actually going to do it uh, there's see one advantage of knowing uh, what everything is like Ooh. Uh, knowing the, the quest line and stuff I know what's going to be coming next, and I can actually time the episodes around them, because it'll probably take a little bit longer to do the next thing for the episode, or the, the next thing in the storyline. It'll probably take an entire episode itself, and that's how I'm going to set it up. Let's see, wood chopping block, but I need a woodcutter's axe now. See, 
I don't think I've ever done this. I've always I've managed to run this. There's already a log to cut. Well, let's cut the log. I have no idea what exactly this is in here for, but that is irrelevant. Harvest all the plants. All the plants. What is this woman? Spend drunk on the job again? What? Just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha. I'll be right down. New to Riverwood? If you're looking for work, of course. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. And it's Both just like that. She just gives me the key. What is wrong with these people? What is wrong with these the people? In Helgen? It can't be. Although... See, now there is a big debate going on in Steam. I thought that must have just been... Well, not really a debate. More of... They're not dragons! And... I'm gonna be honest, what, like, defines a dragon? Because according to him, it's four legs and wings. And with, uh... I don't know why, well, with I the Skyrim dragons, You've got the look of the, someone who's it does technically have dragon. four legs and Things wings. From bad to worse. Now, he's just kind of all like, well, the wings are attached dragons? to the front legs. Therefore, it's a wyvern and not a dragon. But... The thing is, is you look at pictures of wyverns, and that's all there is. The front wing, the wings are the front legs, and there's no feet or anything. But the dragons in this game have feet on the front, so I consider them dragons, even if he doesn't. And I'm sure there's gonna be more of a debate about they're not dragons, they're wyverns. But this isn't debate to the the story, they call it a dragon, therefore it's a dragon. What defines a dragon? It's not a real creature. There's no actual defining thing that says what a dragon is. The game wants to call it a dragon, it's a goddamn dragon. And he's gonna be laughing when he watches this, but, uh, it's, it's a goddamn dragon. Deal with it. Now, oh, apparently I missed some story. I can't remember when I last to start. Well, the news you heard about Alfred was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards. They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial treason for fighting for your own people all of skyrim would have seen the truth then but then out of nowhere a dragon attacked a dragon you told me i didn't believe it at first either well, what do you think i'd be lying you just gave me the key to your house but you won't trust my words what is wrong with you we'd be dead if not for that dragon in the confusion we managed to slip away I wouldn't really call it slip away. We, I mean, we did kind of murder our way through the entire fortress, go through killing everything. We did sneak past a bear, and uh, on the way here, took a short venture through a vi vine, mine, and murdered all of its inhabitants, just to achieve nothing other than the pure slaughter, and become half naked, of which nobody yet has com commented upon yet. Oh? I already asked you that. So somewhere I can buy fresh supplies. supplies. You know, I already know this. I suppose you mean weapons and armor? But of course, woman, what did you think I want? Apples? Okay, well... I could buy armor. However, I can guarantee better armor if I make the armor myself. Therefore, we are going to visit the trader. Here we go. Exactly what we wanted. Wait, am I level two? 
Am I ready to level up already? Well, one of us has to oh, I am. Fail. I'm gonna go for some more stamina. No, I can't put any more points in the sneak. Cause you s oh, requires 20. Okay, maybe I can. Now it requires 40. Uh, backstab is 30, and muffled movement is 30. Stick attacks with one-handed weapons don't do six times damage. Ooh. See, that's one of my ultimate goals. That and, well, that's okay. But this is good, and that's obviously good. And that roll, you can actually sneak attack somebody in the middle of rolling. It's pretty ridiculous. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. What are you two arguing oh, about now? About this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> sorry you had to hear that. Yeah, you are sorry. Now I'm curious. I don't know what you overheard, but... The Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. It would be a very good trader if you closed down just because of an argument. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a, a bit of a, a break in. But oh. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. Hmm. An ornament. Interesting. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Yes, I already know all of this, but I'm trying to add random shenanigans for your guys' entertainment. And I'm going to do this throughout the thing, so if you don't like me pretending to know what's going on, at least in the roleplay sense, because I do know what is going on, and I'm admitting it, but I'm trying to add a bit of a roleplay to it. So, bear with me. If you don't like it, let me know in the comments. But, back to the show. Oh, I could hope you get the claw back. Random accent change. Coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Uh, Queen sounds good. Going to get those thieves. I'll go with the... the, the you find the what do you got oh, for sale? This and a bit what have that. I got for sale? Now the shop window in this is a little strange because I go down here, because you see up here and then down here. Down here allows me to sell stuff in my inventory. Such as these thingies. Uh, might as well sell what I'm wearing too. Sell it all! Sell everything! I need to make sure I don't accidentally sell my dagger. The Book of the Dragonborn! Oop. Well, that's gone. I don't feel like buying it back. Uh, yeah. Why not? That armor forging... Well, I read it when I picked it up, so... Magicka, I'm not gonna really need. Uh, okay. Now, we are up to 869 gold. Bear pelt. It may seem a little expensive. And I believe in Oblivion, they didn't really have a use, the pelts. But in this game, they do have a lot more of a use. And I'll buy some lockpicks. Why not? I suppose I'll look at potions. It's always good to have some healing potions. Down to 493. He has quite a bit of armor for not being the blacksmith. He looks spell terms. But we are not. We are not one of those so mage bastards. Okay. Now, this is the. Uh, the glorious thing about this game. This is the tanning rack. And yes, I'm naked. Now, the thing about the tanning rack is like this, a deer hide turns into two leather, that's what this is saying, and a bear pelt turns into four leather. Now we're gonna make, we're gonna use one leather to make four leather strips. And then, oh, Workbench is used for improving things. We want to use... Actually, I think you use the forge even for leather armor, which is a little bit strange. Or I guess it's hide. Oh, no, here's leather. Oh. 
Whatever you need. He made a comment about me freezing to death. I don't know if you heard that. Not bad. Reminds me when I first started. Well, I'm not planning on continuing smithing. Okay, well, I'm slightly more clothed. We're gonna look and see if this guy has any actual You're armor to sell. New blade? Why don't you sell Until me things? Time. Why don't you sell me things? I think it's because he's leaving. Leave that fancy elven stuff to the elves. See, I don't want iron gear. I want leather gear. Oh, that's not the door. Ike, you the sneaky type? Got some nice daggers around here somewhere. Do you? What if I don't believe you? Lost? Yes, I'm lost. I, I want him to sell me things, but... It's probably the time of day. What are we at? 8.14 p.m. Now before we set off, I want to make sure I have a full set of armor. Which is why I haven't quite stopped yet. And this may seem like an absolute waste of your time. But to be honest, isn't that what watching videos on YouTube is? And playing games and all of such? They're just a glorious waste of time. Hmm. Maybe I need to wait two more? Two. Two. Two! Two! True. Okay. Ah, here he is. You can sell me things now. Okay, he is. He's now. He said something about nice. Oh, yeah. Not interested in the blessed dagger. Hey, the I want to look at apparel, not leave. The the boots, the bracers. Not keen on helmets, so I will let you keep that. And there we go. Oh, I shouldn't be a naked lizard. Look at that. Anyhow, I'm going to perform the quick save and say goodbye for today. I will see you guys next time.